Uh, yeah, so um, this is gaming related, and maybe this is a little bit of the future of gaming. I wanted to hold this over for you guys instead of awesome casts. You're welcome. Um, <clears throat> so like I said, uh, Google um, kind of released this kind of uh, demo pack of games. We've had something before. Uh, I think we talked about on awesome cast the spell least the game. Um, but this is their kind of uh, collection of conceptual things. Now I have a screencast here. It's a little delayed, uh, but you'll get the idea. But, but if you install this pack through the glassware store, um, you, what you'll do is at first you could, of course, go, OK, glass, play a game. And you see we have a selection of stuff here. So right off the bat, uh, the one I've liked the most so far is Balance. Oh, or it's going to open Spellista. That works too. <laughs> and actually, have I shown this one on the show before? Uh -uh. So this one, I have fairly simple. Um, it's just kind of a unscrambling a word, and it's actually telling me in my ear. Oh, she's, she's telling me what to do, so it's not actually letting me select anything. You hold it over. It feels like a Kinect game. Yeah. I love you, man. But I swear to God, if you call Google Glass the future of gaming one more time, I'm going to smack you. <laughs> uh, this is so, let's see. Chachi doesn't want to have a... Uh, do, do crunches for Zelda. Maybe it's going to be a... Or Glass for mobile gaming. Audience. Maybe the future of gaming is going to be a mashup between Google Glass, Kinect... And Oculus Rift. But they have some pretty cool concepts here. So, and I apologize, anybody on audio, uh, we'll put this on YouTube too. So, we have a nice balanced game. Blocks come down, and you actually tilt your head. Uh, and I just realized it's not popping up there. There we go. So, so that's kind of fun. So, you actually get to uh, uh, bounce. And oh, sword sword fail. Oh. <laughs> we'll do another one. Okay, glass. Yeah. Play a they game. look like the the guy from the balance thing. Tennis. Looks like this uh, one. This one gets a little weird because I feel like I have to turn too far for it. They look like Ter Terrence and Philip from South Park. A little bit. So <laughs> it actually kind of serves it back, and I should move my head, and I should be able to get it in the circle to hit it back. That's not tennis. Up, up, it says it's tennis. It looks like for those on the audio. It looks like somebody's bouncing a ball at your face as yeah, fast as they can. Yeah, you see how far I had to move my head in order to hit, to hit that one ball? Like, it I looks think like he, a flash game that you had you, to do the, the paddle and the ball thing. Okay, glass. Do you, do you have to, like, headbutt the ball? Uh, what's that? Do you have to head, headbutt the ball? I don't like balls flying at my face. <laughs> or how about Shape Splitter? And then this is basically Fruit Ninja. Now, I, I was doing this in too dark of a room before, but actually I have to Cut. See, yeah. avoid the bombs. So yeah, it's Fruit Ninja. It's basically Fruit Ninja. It's Fruit Ninja. Fruit Ninja! I like the bomb. Yeah, it blows up. Fruit Ninja. And Sword Explodes. Sword Explodes. Uh, okay, Glass. <laughs> Sword Explosion. Play a game. Uh, clay Shooter. Now, here's probably the most annoying one if you're in a room full of old friends. Does it feature a laughing dog? Does are it say... To, oh, are you about to shout things? Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shoot. Bang! Bang! You have to say yep. bang! You have to say bang. That's bang. the best. Nope. <laughs> Sorry, you suck Pull. at this game. Pull bang. Well, every time I look up for it, 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 I'm looking right up into the light in the studio, so it's not working out too well. Oof. <laughs> Oof. Pull. Bang. You know, the fun thing is, it's actually reacting to everything bang. I'm saying. So you don't have to exactly say bang. pull and bang. Pull bang. Pull, pull bang. Pull bang. Pull bang. Pull bang. Bang. Uh, you get the idea. <laughs> Short, you, you, this you're is not some, good at this game, are you? I'm looking great, up at the light. It's <laughs> this is some great audio podcast. It's, it's, okay, the light, it's the light's fault. Google? Oh, uh, my. I'm sorry, not Google. And actually, it's telling me I need to cool down. Okay, Glass. Play a game. Okay, Glass. Take an ice bath. Matcher. And then this is just a kind of a... This is just a shape matching game. But it's kind of fun how... It feels like you're in a 3D space for this one. And again, it's just a matching game, but... It looks like you're on a TARDIS. Yeah! I don't know what that means. Glass is bigger on the inside. 
There it is. Yay. Yeah, sorry. you did it. <laughs> you mean the smaller on the outside. Yeah, so smaller. that gives you an idea. I, again, these are just kind of, they they really just feel like tech demos at this point. Like kind of like early Wii U games that they always showed off before. Obviously, they mm. haven't done much with it since. So I'm kind of curious to see where they go with this. And this is the first kind of look at uh, gaming they've been doing on a device like this. Um, so I, I, it sounds like you guys are fairly unimpressed so far. Um, no, I said it was, no, was all right. I, I'm okay with all of them except for the tennis. Yeah. Um, that seems a little too intense for something like that. <laughs> um, but like the, the shape match or the, the Fruit Ninja one or the shooting one, I could get behind. It's yeah. better than a Virtual Boy. It is better than a Virtual Boy. It is definitely Boy. better than Virtual <laughs> Boy. But again, it's a kind of a first step. I actually had the problem. Apparently something was off with the unit because it was spinning everything like like – Something That's got screwed weird. up with like like its level, I, and, and well, I, bet you. I thought the games were broken, and and I actually went into that one thing, Chachi, we talked about where um, the the secret thing where you're in the room with all the developers, and oh. that was spinning. That was fun. Um, oh. oh, I bet you got sick from that. So I I don't know. It's um it, it it's it's a pretty cool start. Some of them seem a little harder than others. All of them are better than that Frogger game we tried ages ago. <laughs> um, but again, like so, some things just seem a little weird. Like the like, like I said, the tennis one, where like I have to I have to turn all the way around sometimes in order to uh, find the ball. So I think it just needs kind of cal calibrated a little bit. Um, but a pretty cool, free, uh, uh, fun thing for Google Glass, and you know maybe it'll develop into something a little more interesting. I want them to do Ingress on this thing. <laughs> Chachi, I know you've been playing that. That would be cool. Like they they like walk around and you just see like like because they they were just, like. On the map, they're like uh, energy pouring out of the portals, right? Yeah. So, like, what if you just like walk down the street and you saw like the portal like coming out of the ground or something like that, or like in the area or something? Like, it becomes more of an augmented reality, uh, and you can kind of see at least with that matching game a little bit of like you know being able to kind of see in a three D space there, um, you know, as you move side to side on, on the matching game. Uh, you so think like, games see games like that would work. Mm -hmm. You could play portal for real. But like I don't know, it right now it, you can't get too intense with it or it's just not gonna work. No, definitely not. And that's why it's I think gonna be, that's why I think they're easing into it with uh these sorts of sorts of demos. It'd be a huge turnoff. Mm-hmm.